Yeah, so the elders in this, these communities, they know they have this innate understanding of how the ecosystem works and how they're a part of it and passing that on to the next generation is super important, especially as these youth are they're getting more exposure to Western culture and um, the communities outside of this area. The Project uh, has been going on for a few decades now and it's uh, an organization that's run by and for Kaipo people uh, to help protect their, their land. So the primary uh, motivation behind the organization is to preserve the Kaipo lands and the culture. So we've been working on a project with this group of Kaipo for the last few years. Uh, going out into the forest and finding some locations where there's a lot of animals and kind of trying to understand what the biodiversity is like in this region. Um, so going out and we've been camera trapping the area. So we've just collected about 10 camera traps that have been out in the forest for a week and we're transferring the photos onto the computer and they're writing down all the names of all the species that we find on the camera traps in their native language, uh, Mabinoque, in Portuguese. Ele quer te perguntar sobre por que a equipe do B é importante, né? Porque proteção na floresta é importante. Bem, a minha bem vai me irmã Bokin, me irmã Bokin, me irmã Puka Kunikin. Quando vai me irmã Puka Kangakit, me irmã Puka Nyono Kajikit, quando vai me irmã Kuben Jalakit Jari, Kuben Ganipiru, Pajadiru, Yalakit Kajik, me irmã me irmã. Boa me mutar aqui. Itabjo, a mu itabjo camicla, caju, bo, cuclinei além nono caju. Me ba me imã bo quin. Não. Não. Caju me ba me bo camiba, bo camiju, a mi pluo iba. Yeah. Não. So all the Kaipo projects aim to source sustainable incomes for uh, defending their territory and incentivizing conservation. So they've got a project collecting Brazil nuts and selling those as uh, fair trade sustainable products. Same with Kumaru seeds. Um, and we've got some ecotourism projects with fly fishing catch and release project going on. And they've got this incredible understanding of the area and the history of the area and uh, the ecosystems around them and they've got this really strong sense of conservation within their culture um, and this ecosystem is incredibly important not just to the Kaipo but to the world in, in general in terms of the biodiversity, the carbon sequestration, all these ecosystem services uh, that this forest and this river provides is crucial and so then passing along to the next generation this culture of conservation this culture where your lifestyle aligns with preserving the ecosystem and protecting it is is really important especially as the youth are coming into contact with technology coming into contact with the internet and the western world and the western way of viewing things keeping this strong sense of of conservation and uh, integration into your ecosystem is really important <laughs>